Okay, so this is just gonna be a no-frills kind of video. I'm just gonna carve a pumpkin and I was thinking of doing Weeping Angels from Doctor Who. Uh, I already cleaned the pumpkin here. I ripped off all the seeds and stuff and from the inside. I'll have to put some toothpicks in there to block it from falling in for, for the top. I made the top a little smaller because this is gonna be a face. And what I got here is some woodworking carving knives. So I noticed a few things when I was carving. I have this half circle carver type thing. It's really good to flip it um, over to do the teeth so that you get the curve curvature of the teeth here. And for the wrinkles, I do I use a really small semicircle and then you go through the lines here. And I basically took off all the skin with this big circle thing a little bit at a time gap between the teeth is really thin so then I used this uh, this V-shaped cutter. So I started with the nose. This is basically the front of the pumpkin here and then I just knew the nose really needed uh, some depth so then I just started from there and went, went deeper in there. You can see the cheek is a little bit too high but that's okay and right now I have the face that's um, it looks a little fat compared to the real one. This one is a bit, he's a little bit skinnier here, this weeping angel. And then I still have the hair to do, but it seems like it's, I can't make the hair come out like this, so um, I'm gonna have to find something else to, to put on here. Anyway, so right now I'm going to try to make him skinnier. I'm basically going in here and make it like come in a bit more over here. If this is in the way, it looks kind of ugly, so I'm just going to cut away. So I'm just going to spray this face with some lemon juice and hopefully it will pres preserve it with some vitamin C that's inside the lemon. Careful when you're doing this, um, whenever you're pushing towards it, don't push it towards your hand. Always make sure you're pushing away or if you're pushing towards, make sure you have extra grip so that you don't cut yourself. I decided to use some black spray paint with a brush, so I guess I'm not going to eat this after all. I'm just tossing in a light to light the mouth. So there you have it what I call a weeping angel pumpkin. Don't forget to click thumbs up for my video and subscribe. Thanks for watching.